Our next drill is our shoulder internal rotation pails and rails. So the setup, as you see, we're going to be working Miles' left shoulder here. So he's lying on his left side. His torso spine is totally straight. His knees are pulled up to the height of his hips, so we have a 90 degree hip flexion and also a 90 degree knee flexion. Miles' head is elevated, so if you can do that, it's going to make this drill a little bit more comfortable. We're going to begin by having a slight amount of wrist extension on the side that we're going to be doing the internal rotation. Miles is going to begin with his elbow position right at the height of his shoulder here. He's going to be starting taking the forearm towards the ground here feeling for the rotation of the shoulder, making sure that the rotation is coming from here and the shoulder blade doesn't pop up with him. After a 10 count in that position, he's going to take his opposite hand, in this case the right, and he's going to take the back of his forearm on his left side into his right hand and vice versa. So they're meeting towards one another for a 10 count. And following that 10 count, he's going to remain there with his right hand and take his left arm down closer to the ground for a 10 second hold also.